Hi everyone, I'm John Buller and I'm pleased and privileged to be able to contribute to this 21 days of prayer initiative at Vernon Alliance Church and offer some reflection on Psalm 100. And um, I've been enjoying the, the passion paraphrase as a devotional tool in my life. So I will share from the uh, passion Psalm 100. Lift up a great shout of joy to the Lord. Go ahead, do it everyone, everywhere. As you serve him, be glad and worship him. Sing your way into his presence with joy. The NIV says, enter his gates with thanksgiving and his courts with praise. And um, I love that, but I really enjoy the poetry of this. Uh, Sing your way into his presence with joy and realize what that really means. We have the privilege of worshiping the Lord our God, for he is our creator and we belong to him. We are the people of his pleasure. So God takes great pleasure in you. Um, Yeah, these are all things that really move me to worship, that move me to prayer. Um, You can pass through his open gates with the password of praise. I love that. So praise is our password as we enter in to uh, worship the Lord. Praise is the password. He's calling us to praise. And um, Augustine uh, said, the one who uh, sings, prays twice. And so even um, I like to think my songs are my prayers. And uh, perhaps you agree. And uh, so I'm moved to worship and praise God uh, through this psalm and through those words that uh, my praise is a password into his courts. Come into his presence with thanksgiving. Come bring your thank offering to him and affectionately bless his beautiful name. For the Lord is always good and ready to receive you. He's so loving that it will amaze you, so kind that it will uh, it will um, astound you. Excuse me. He's so loving that it will amaze you and he's so kind that it will astound you. And he's famous for his faithfulness toward all. Everyone knows our God can be trusted for he keeps his promise to every generation. So one of the things about Psalm 100 is it's a psalm at the beginning. It says a poetic song for Thanksgiving. And uh, if you study a little bit about Psalm 100, you'll learn that it's one of the psalms that we're called to be uh, cheerfully thankful in other translations. And so the heart of this psalm is to enter his courts with uh, thanksgiving and his gates, enter his gates with thanksgiving and his courts with praise. Um, And praise is our password. And we sing our way into his presence. We do that cheerfully. And that means that sometimes we we may not feel cheerful, (laughs) but God is calling us to enter with that cheerful, with that attitude in our hearts of gratitude and thankfulness to him. So I encourage you, whether you're celebrating uh, or whether you're struggling, um, to try and turn your heart and the posture of your heart towards God in thankfulness, uh, because he calls us, he calls us to do that. I sometimes say uh, when we share our burdens, they're divided. And when we share our joys, they're multiplied. We share our joys and they're multiplied. We share our burdens and they're divided. And so we come and we share, um, we we give that stuff over uh, perhaps to each other in group worship and certainly over to God. Uh, The other thing about Psalm 100 that I'm encouraged by is this entering his courts uh, idea means that there's a a further uh, journey. There's... um, uh, there's a holy of holies. And what Jesus has done through his death and resurrection is torn that curtain. Um, when that miracle moment happened, um, the curtain was torn in the temple so that we, you and I, could enter into the holy of holies. So in your worship, in your prayer, uh, don't stop at the outer courts. Uh, press in, press into uh, an intimacy with the Lord where you are known and you know him. And uh, so, yeah, those are my reflections on someone, Psalm 100 and how it moves me to prayer. And uh, I hope and pray that uh, that is uh, something that can uh, encourage you today. 
uh, thank you. And um, let me just pray. And I said, the one who sings prays twice, that Augustine quote. So I'm just going to sing a little bit of a song that I wrote uh, called Thankful. I will bring my praise to you, an offering I'm thankful. Victories are multiplied, sorrows divide, and I'm thankful. My sacrifice to you in spirit and in truth. You are the one who created the seas, yet you sing over me and I'm thankful. All of creation that joins in the song and the saints sing along. We are thankful. You are the one who created the seas, yet you sing over me and I'm thankful. All of creation that joins in the song and the saints sing along. We are thankful. Amen.